2005, the Airbus A380, the largest commercial jet ever built, is en route to the Dubai Air Show. 560 tons at takeoff, a massive 80 meter wingspan. Airbus has designed the world's first super jumbo to carry up to 850 passengers in unprecedented luxury. This aircraft cannot be a failure. Either it's going to be that flagship of the 21st century or it's going to be a disaster. But the A380 is running way behind schedule and in danger of becoming a financial catastrophe. If Airbus doesn't deliver by the end of 2006, customers will start cancelling orders and the company could go bust. I think Airbus has run out of lives now. It cannot afford any more delays. Behind the scenes, Airbus is racing against the clock to untangle a wiring problem that's become a major industrial nightmare. And the elite flight test team is battling the elements to complete the final critical phase of the A380 safety certification. Will the world's biggest airliner deliver on time? The Dubai Air Show, an international gathering of unimaginable wealth and glamour. With the snap of his golden scissors, the Emirates Crown Prince Sheikh Mohammed Maktoum opens the show. The first exhibit he visits is the A380. Emirates have ordered 45 of the Super Jumbos for a first delivery in just over one year. At $300 million in aircraft, Emirates want to be sure that the A380 is worth their investment and running on schedule. As the Sheikh and his entourage step inside the Super Jumbo, the Airbus top brass are quick to remind them that this A380 is merely a flight test prototype. But like most A380 customers, the Sheikh has just one vital question. Like Emirates, Airbus customers throughout the world want to know when. Like Emirates, they have all invested massive sums of money in interior design, route scheduling, 